Well, sometimes all it takes is a little perseverance and a positive attitude to make it through, no matter how hopeless a situation can seem. And that's the message one Orange County man's hoping to convey through children's books. News 6 at 9's Nadine Yana shows us his journey from homeless to author. From being homeless, sleeping in his car on the side of I-4, to being a five-time children's book author, 68-year-old Eddie Ingram is teaching children how to believe in themselves. I was homeless, but I always said I had a job, and that job was to find work. Even though it was the toughest chapter of his life, Eddie Ingram never let being homeless define him. Some people get stuck in that life, you know, but I always said, well, I... There was a way out. And never let go of his goal to succeed. I went to Barnett Park one morning, early one morning, around there and took my ironing board out under the, one of the pavilions and washed up in the cold water and went out looking for work. You know, I ironed my clothes there, you know. I did what I had to do. And in this chapter, it paid off. Eddie waking up one of those mornings to go to a job fair that led him to a job at Orange TV, the county's television studio where he's been for the last 23 years. That's where I got started in the Air Force. I was a motion picture photographer at my last duty squadron was a TV squadron. Eddie also volunteers and mentors kids through the school district and reads to kids at Head Start, going to an event at UCF where he got the idea to write a children's book. I said, you know what, I could do that myself. And guess what, I could do that myself. And boy, did he already have a story. Being a man of one you see as a man in life, I chose to be. Memorized in his head. I woke up one day and I said, hooray, I found a place in life for me. That story was his. That's what I, who I am today. Eddie now wrapping up his fifth children's book. These two just came out, um, Little Boy and Run, Philip, Run. Each of them. Philip be, deals with peer pressure. With lessons to learn in the end. Philip ended up making... Those individuals that didn't care for him, that made fun of him, his friends, by being himself, by believing in himself. And that's what I want people to understand in my books. You can be whatever you want to be in life, but you have to believe first in yourself. So you could check out Eddie's books at any Orange County Public Library. You can also order them on Amazon. In Orlando, I'm Nadine Yanis, getting results, News 6.